hello guys welcome to the next video on bootstrap tutorial for beginners in this video we will see how we can add a carousel on our bootstrap web page so let's get started first of all I will go to my index.html page and from here I will remove this jumbotron div element because in place of this we are going to add a carousel and then add a div element here first of all let's define the ID so ID and give some name to your ID for example my carousel and then include a class called carousel slide and then uh, one more thing we need to add is data minus ride and this will be equal to carousel okay so add this div element and inside this div element first of all we are going to add the indicators and to add indicators we need to add this ordered list element so just add ol and include a class call carousel indicator and inside this ordered list we need to add some uh, list items and for the list item we need to add first of all data target and our data target is what we have defined above so we have uh, defined my carousel here so our data target will be this and then we want to add the data slide number okay so data slide to equal to and set it to zero for uh, now for the first slide and then just copy this uh, list item from here and paste it three times because we are going to show uh, three carousel pictures and you just need to change the number here slide number zero one two okay and to set which uh, slide will be active we can set uh, this slide as active so whatever slide you want that this slide should be active uh, initially then you can add this uh, class active to it class is equal to now just below this order list we are going to add one more dev element and this will be for our pictures for example and now add a class called carousel inner and inside this div element we are going to add one more div element for the item so just add class item here okay and uh, for the active item which you want uh, active you just add active okay and this I will explain uh, a little bit later when we see the demo and here you can add the source for your image so just add uh, image tag here and then as a source you can add the location of your uh, pictures so for example I have uh, some pictures to show as the carousel picture 1 2 and uh, 3 and make sure these pictures uh, are of same resolution so uh, whenever these picture uh, uh, slides over each other the size of these picture will be same okay so this is in my image folder of my bootstrap folder okay so I can give the location as img slash one dot jpg okay in the same way you can add uh, more pictures so just copy this div element and paste it to more times and uh, you just need to change the name of your picture picture 2 and picture 3 one more thing you need to remember here is you just remove the active from other two slides and just leave this active uh, class to only one uh, image right otherwise all three uh, images will be active and in here I think this should be uh, carousel indicators so carousel minus indicators okay so just change it to carousel minus indicators okay and let's save our code and run it and now it looks like this so you have your first image uh, which is active 
and you have these three indicators right we haven't added any controls to uh, this carousel and now we are going to add these controls to our carousel okay now for adding the controls to our carousel images what we need to do is we just need to go below our inner carousel div element and we are going to add it as a link so just add a and add a class called left carousel control and then add a h ref or reference which uh, refer to our id called my carousel which is this one and this will be the button for our carousel slide and the data slide of this uh, carousel will be previous right and inside this what we can do is we can add a span here and just add this class called glyphicon space glyphicon minus kevron minus left and this is for adding uh, this image to the left hand side which will be like a, a previous button right and same we just copy this uh, link element from here paste it down and instead of left now we are going to do it right so right and this data slide will be next and instead of uh, left image we will add a right image okay and now just save your program and open it in the browser and now we will be able to see our carousel images so this is our first image which is active and this is our indicator which was active and then you can change from these buttons uh, these images so this is our second image and this is our third image and these are the indicator which changes with the image so first indicator for first image second indicator for second image and third indicator for third image right and if you wait for some time they will uh, change uh, automatically so our carousel is working now and we can add some more properties to this carousel for example uh, the interval for changing these slides so just go to your uh, carousel div element here and here you can add an uh, attribute called data interval and here you can uh, set the time in millisecond so for example i set it here 1000 millisecond which is one second so your slide will change in one second right so i will refresh my page and now you will be able to see it's uh, changing every second right so here you can uh, you know uh, manage your time what time interval you want to give to uh, change the carousel image one more thing which you can do is you can add the caption to your carousel so just go to your uh, carousel inner class and inside your item here uh, for example uh, this item which has image one just below your image element add a div tag here and instead of item active you can add this class called carousel caption right and in here you can use any uh, html tag for example h1 and for example you can say theme one okay and same we can do for other uh, items also so just copy this carousel caption class and go to image two just below this paste it and just below image three also paste it and this is theme two and this is theme three okay save your code and run it once again and now you will be able to see that the, there is a caption theme one here theme two here and theme three here so you can even add your captions or uh, your text uh, in your carousel image. So in this way, you can use carousel in Bootstrap. I hope you have enjoyed this video. Please write, comment, and subscribe, and 
Bye for now.